everyone and welcome to another shop my stash video this type of videos i create every week because i need to renew my everyday drawer every week in order for me to in order to keep me over from overspending money on makeup that i don't need can you relate to that i think everybody can relate to that all right here we go i uh we're gonna talk about the things that i had in my uh, drawer last week and then we're gonna go through my collection and grab some others that we need for this christmas week are you ready let's get into it so here's what we had this week for base makeup i would have to say this nyx marshmallow primer not necessarily my favorite it's an okay primer it feels it's just a little bit i don't know like it's poor feeling but not a whole lot and it's kind of tightens your skin a little bit it's not a very hydrating i feel like sometimes can be a little drying i do like this one better this is really hydrating and very glowy i love the glossy one from touch and salt this one is not necessarily my favorite but it's okay i can say it was a bad primer we had the luminous silk foundation which i absolutely adore i did record a short video which uh, you can go and uh, watch that out to see how it performs the born this way foundation i foundation it's not a foundation is the concealer i do love the prime the dior powder it is one of my favorites and then the revolution pro from the under eyes really beautiful as well this is the natasha denona bronze and glow i really love the bronzer i really hate the highlighter the highlighter it's a little clumpy it's a little i just i don't like it how it looks on me um the hot mama um blush it is really nice also this milk uh blush as well is very pretty i would uh go and put these back into my drawer this one too i'm gonna put this one in my empties because it's very close to be empty and i'm not gonna use it one more week so this is gonna go in my empty and all of the rest of them are gonna go back in my drawer the two brow products from charlotte tilbury that i have is the brow sheet and the legendary brow i believe it's called uh which is a brow gel i have them in dark brown i do really enjoy them i've been talking about this for the past month i and i really do enjoy them i think um they're gonna be close to be done at least the brow sheet i think is gonna be very close to like finish it i'm gonna keep them one more week uh for the lipstick i really do like this one from private society it's more like a um, gloss than a um lipstick liquid lipstick so i really did like that the lip balm from pat mcgrath i do enjoy it as well and uh, the lip pencil from jerry cosmetic from sheer it is really beautiful i was presently surprised of the quality of uh, domini cosmetic lipstick i have this one that it is in if i could see nude cocoa which is really nice and then i did order a um, mystery box from um, beautylish that had wayne goss products it took forever to get to me i did record that video i'm gonna see if i have time to put that one up as well but i did receive some lip uh, liners and i do enjoy them and then i also received some eye pencils as well which are really nice as well so these all of them are gonna get out with the exception of the charlotte tilbury one now the elf uh, mascara was really nice i was very surprised how beautiful this looks it is a very good one very cheap six dollars this is totally worth it totally worth it um very nice volume is not it's not uh causing me any problems like flakiness or anything like that it is a little bit at the end of the day it does transfer just a little bit but not a whole lot um and it's really nice it stays uh, nice and curl all day and the climax one from uh, nars is really nice i love 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 this one the same with the liner from one size i love it as well i'm gonna take all of these out as well the spray from abh dewy set is really nice i'm gonna keep this for another week because i want to make sure i I, uh, enjoy it but for so far i really did like it now let's talk about the two eyeshadow palettes that i had this week okay so this nyx thing i have not tried it yet um was supposed to but for some reason i 
never got around it so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna keep this one in for one more week and then the nabla side by side palette is really beautiful i love the way it blends the shimmers are so pretty i love this eyeshadow palette it is all a little bit more sultry and sexier when you apply it on the eyes than the way it looks in the pan i really do like this and then of course makeup kick i created a look with this i'm gonna put it up here so you can see but i got compliments all day by wearing that it was absolutely beautiful the shimmer is to die for it's so easy to blend i love the shades i love the the um, eyeshadow formula from makeup kick all right now let's hit the drawers to pick our new items for foundations I did order this one from RCMA Makeup. I don't feel like I want to try that one right now. So I'm just going to let that one go. I do have this one that I kind of want to try. Also, I want to go with the one from uh, Charlotte Tilbury. Mm, I do want this one too. This week is a little bit of a tougher decision because it's Christmas, right? So you want to wear something that i like but i also want to try some stuff so i don't know i'm not sure do i want to go with this this combination or do i want to go with this let's try this one yeah let's do the healthy one um and then let's see powder okay let's see what are we gonna do for powder should i go with huda beauty i'm gonna try it again yeah, we'll do the Huda Beauty one, and then, uh, I'm not sure, do I want anything for under the eyes? Let's do this one. I'm gonna do the Marc Jacob one, finish line. Now for a uh, blush and bronzer, I got this one from Wayne Goss, which I really want to try, so I'm gonna put this one for bronzer. As for blush, I'm not quite sure what I want to do this week. Um, should we get something like really pretty? I want something that I haven't tried in like a long, long time. You know what I mean? Maybe we should go with this one. I'll do cover effects. For primer, mm, I'm not sure what I want to do. Should I try this one again? I'm not sure. I don't quite like those type of primers. Mm, so I think I might just go with the milk one. And then for concealer, I think I'm just going to... I'm just going to go with the Charlotte Tilbury one. For highlighter, I'm going to try one of these Laura Lee Los Angeles. I'm going to get this one right here. I don't know which one is this one. And I'm going to get with this one. I have a lot of mascaras in here that I want to try. So I'm going to actually go with this one from Huda Beauty. I haven't tried this one yet. And... Um, yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna open this one up. I'm also gonna grab from this drawer. I'm gonna grab this Nabla really sparkly um, thingy. And then I think I'm just gonna get some liners in here too. I'm gonna go with this one from Makeup Kit, which is a nude one. And I'm just gonna let's see what else is in here. I'm gonna get this blue one. And we have so many eyeshadow palettes in here um, that I know I wanted to use more, but unfortunately I haven't gotten around it. Um, these are not all my eyeshadow palettes. These are just the ones that I just wanted to use it a little bit more. Um, and I think, I just think I'm just going to go maybe with this one all the way at the bottom. Yeah, I'm going to get the native one. We'll give it a try this week. 
Okay, so a quick look how this looks like. This is the bronzer. This is the blush. I really like how they look like. Also, this is the eyeshadow palette, the native one from XL Beauty. And then here's the bronze uh, highlighting powder from literally Los Angeles. It's going to be a little dark, but we'll see how I'm going to make it work and then of course we do have the physician's formula the healthy foundation i have mine in uh, mn3 i believe yes mn3 then i have the huda beauty powder in banana bread i also have this uh, curl and length volume uh, mascara which I really wanted to try and I'm so glad that I got it in gratis I do have this lipstick that I'm really excited to try this is the 999 from Dior uh, the icon lip liner from uh, Huda Beauty also the Cinco de Mayo um, lipstick from Huda Beauty the uh, liner from Makeup Geek in uh, nude and then infallible L'Oreal in blue and then, of course, I have the Nabla sparkly things and next thing. But pretty much this is what we have uh, this week. This is what I'm going to use. And I also have this Charlotte Tilbury uh, concealer, the Hydro Grip Milk uh, Primer, and this Marc Jacobs powder. And, uh, yeah, we'll let you know how this everything worked out for me. Thank you so much for watching, and I cannot wait to see you all next time. Have a nice one. Merry Christmas. Bye.